This message is for all those who get benefits from Social Security, SSISSDI, and Veteran Affairs. Get ready to experience a money infusion like you've never experienced it before. Get ready for a revolutionary news that will completely alter your perspective on your financial situation. Keep an eye out for information on how you can obtain additional payments totaling an astounding $3,600 and join the ranks of beneficiaries who are about to enjoy a significant increase in benefits that will change their lives forever. A new game is being played with today's video. You are set to get a staggering $3,600 in new payments if you are receiving benefits from the Department of Veterans Affairs, Social Security, Social Security, Disability Insurance, or Social Security Disability Insurance. You wouldn't want to miss out on this video at any cost. Legal immigration is a major cause for concern since it has the potential to place a burden on public services, particularly in situations where undocumented workers do not pay taxes. With legal migration, on the other hand, there are typically less concerns that are raised. According to a paper that was published by the Center for Immigration Studies in the year 2023, it was suggested that legal immigrants who arrived in the United States at a later age could potentially cause issues for Social Security. According to the analysis, these immigrants have the potential to constitute a net drain on the Social Security system, particularly if they are persons with lower incomes. It is intriguing to consider that legal migration can pose difficulties for Social Security officials. Contrary to what most people believe, it was stated by the Center for Immigration Studies that legal immigrants who arrived later in life could potentially draw more money from Social Security than they contributed, which could put a burden on the system. This viewpoint is sophisticated and questions the common wisdom that has been prevalent. Right now, let's talk about the most obvious problem in the room. It is not what you might anticipate to be the most significant immigration issue facing Social Security. Unexpectedly, it is not illegal immigration that is depleting the system. Rather, it is the lack of immigration that is the problem. A portion of the funding for Social Security comes from the two trust funds that it maintains, while the rest of the program's expenses are covered by recurring payroll taxes. According to a report that was published in 2019 by the Bipartisan Center, immigration helps to strengthen the solvency of the social security system by increasing the number of new workers without instantly adding more beneficiaries. It was brought to light in this report that immigration that takes place at very young ages leads to an increase in the number of workers well before the number of people receiving social security benefits grows. Migration that is legal, as opposed to migration that is illegal, is what the study is referring to. It is an intriguing viewpoint that suggests that an increase in the number of migrants entering the country could potentially benefit Social Security by increasing the amount of money collected through payroll taxes. However, and there is always a but, the most significant issue that Social Security faces is that its trust assets will be depleted by the year 2034. According to the harsh reality, Social Security is facing a huge financial burden despite the fact that there is the possibility that lawful migration could be beneficial. The imminent depletion of trust funds has the potential to endanger the entire system, which in turn raises concerns about the system's ability to continue operating. Now that we have shifted our attention to Capitol Hill, let us investigate the viewpoint of Republicans on immigrants and fraudulent activity on Social Security. One of the representatives emphasized how significant the problem is. According to the report, there were 1.2 million instances of illegal aliens using social security numbers in 2017. This was in response to the spike in unlawful mass migration. These are astonishing and worrisome numbers to start with. On the other hand, the representative brings to light a change in policy guidelines. The administration of President Trump took proactive measures to combat social security theft by informing one. Six million businesses of individuals whose social security numbers did not match the records kept by the central government. On the other hand, after the year 2017, the administration of Vice President Joe Biden was responsible for the immigration of five million illegal aliens and put an end to the practice of notifying employers of unlawful use of social security numbers. Despite the fact that social security fraud is causing a lot of harm and that a growing number of legal foreigners are committing it, the representative contends that there is no certainty that an illegal alien who commits fraud can be deemed inadmissible or removed from the United States. 
streamlining the analysis and ensuring that criminal aliens can be held accountable and removed from the country as quickly as possible for victimizing Americans through social security and identification document fraud are two of the aspects of the proposed measure that attempt to address this. Situation. On the other hand, before we get into this discussion about money, there is something even more significant on the horizon. From now until this inflation roller coaster comes to an end, lawmakers and senators are working to ensure that all individuals and dependents receive monthly checks of $2,000, regardless of their income. How do you feel about it? In the comments section below, please share your ideas. You should give your view. It is no longer necessary for an immigrant to get a work permit once they have already obtained lawful permanent resident status. The fact that immigrants who have work permits or who have obtained lawful permanent resident status are now able to qualify for social security payments in the same manner as residents of the United States is a significant departure from the previous situation. In order to be eligible, you will need to accumulate 40 credits of coverage, which is an essential aspect to bear in mind. Now, however, here is the true twist. The issue of immigration is a significant one for Social Security, but it is not the one that you might be thinking about. There have been other reports that have come to the conclusion that the influence of immigration on Social Security extends beyond what is commonly believed. According to the findings of a poll that was carried out by the Nationwide Retirement Institute, seniors consider issues such as inflation and the possibility of reductions in Social Security benefits to be their most significant concerns. The annual cost of living adjustments are intended to resolve the connection between inflation and social security, which is a close relationship between the two. That being said, what exactly is the relationship between immigration and social security? It has come to light that the unfavorable impression of immigration that is frequently depicted in the media may not be the most accurate portrayal of the current scenario. In spite of the fact that politicians routinely acknowledge the surge of illegal immigrants crossing the southern border of the United States as a significant problem, there is a significant immigration reform measure that is being proposed by both parties in an effort to address this issue. Now we will move on to the most important part, the time that we have all been anticipating. Checks, valued $3,600 that are brand new. For millions of people who have received benefits, this is a momentous turning point. Watch this space to find out everything there is to know about the financial windfall that is going to be delivered to your pockets. But hold on. There's more to come. The letter that you received in the summer of 2023 was very important. Do you remember it? Try not to lose it. The additional funds can be accessed with the help of this element. In the following video, we will explain why it is so crucial, so make sure you stay for the full duration of the movie. Moreover, here's the deal. Your viewpoint is the most important thing. Is there a certain amount of an increase that you would want to see in your monthly benefits? $100? $200? $300? Now, let's talk about inflation, otherwise known as the elephant in the room. 